Hello guys, it's Golden One Two here. Welcome to a brand new video. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to use Canva in a few minutes. Canva is a free graphic design platform that is great for making banners, invitations, business cards, YouTube thumbnail, Instagram posts, and more. Canva has a drag and drop interface that makes customizing thousands of templates simple and easy. With the free version of Canva, you have access to features that will allow you to edit photos without an extensive photo editing knowledge so quickly i'm just going to teach you how to use canva so if you're a beginner ensure you watch this video to the end this is just what you need to start creating designs on canva now the first thing you need to do is to go over to canva.com let me just open uh, a browser first thing you need to do go to canva.com now once you go to canva.com come to this place that says sign up and then click on sign up and register with your email your google account or your facebook account now once you're done with that you log into your account and then you you'll be on this own page which is this page you're seeing right now to create a design you either start with a template or you start with a custom size that is if you know the size of the design you want to create now if you know the size of the design come over to this place that says custom size click on it and then Click on it and then to ask you for the width and the height of the design you want to create and ask you if the design is in inches, in pixels, in mm or in cm. Now if you don't know the size of the design you want to create, you can come over to this place. You see different templates. This is a template for flyer, for Facebook cover, for resume, for A4 documents, for Instagram story, for banner, for desktop wallpaper, for Instagram, for business card. This is a template for the video, for presentation. So they have a lot of templates. If you can't find the template here, another option you have is to come over to the search bar and search for what you want to create. Now, let's assume I'm creating a Pinterest pin. Let me click on Pinterest. Pinterest pin. Let's let's assume I want to create a Pinterest pin. Now, to search for Pinterest pin, Canva is going to bring out different templates that I can customize. These are different templates that I can use to create my design. Now, what you need to do next is just to go through the page and then... Click on any template and customize the template to your taste. Now, if you come over to the left hand side, you can see other options. If you're looking for a modern design, if you're looking for a simple design or a, an elegant design, all you have to do is to click on any of these options and it will bring out more designs. Let's say I want to create a certificate. I'll come over to this place, the search bar, and then type certificate. Canva is going to bring out different templates that I can edit and then download and use so these are different templates so i'm just going to go through the page and pick a template so i think i love the first um few templates i saw let me just go pick those templates i love this template so i'm going to click on it and then i'll be giving different features that will enable me to edit the design now once you um open the the template please take note of this tab this white tab it changes depends on what you click on your design if i click on the word certificates this part has changed you can see that this part has changed let me click out and so that you can see what i'm saying now the part has this um tab has animate that is the only feature there animate right if i click on anything on the certificate now this tab is going to change if i click on certificate now it has the font tab it has um the tab for me to change the color of the text it has um the tab for me to change the font size either to increase it or to decrease it it has effect that animates that's a lot of things if i click on the background of the design it's going to change again it's going to bring out this color this background color for me to be able to change the background and then for me to animate for me to be able to animate the design now it depends on what you click right so anytime you click on anything on your design make sure you come over to this place this white tab for you to see the different features there that you can use to modify the design now for this design i'm just going to come over to this place where the name is i'll click on it to change or edit a text all you need to do is to click on it and then delete the text there and add your text so i'm going to add my name go to one soon and then i'm done with that if you don't like the font you have an option of changing the font to do that just click on the text and then come over to this part this place is where to change the font let me change the font to something else so i'm just going to go through this place and change the font 
please do not click on these fonts that has yellow on them they are not free you can choose any other font so let me just go through the different font that are available okay so i think i'm going to go with this one now as i click on it it's going to change right so this is the font i don't like it so i'm going to choose um so guys you just have to keep trying um different fonts till you get what you're okay with okay so i think i'm okay with this font so i'm just going to leave this font here then i can decide to increase the font size or decrease the font size to do that just come over to this place the plus sign allows you to increase the font size then the minus sign will allow you to decrease the font size now i think i'm okay with this okay so i'm going to come over to this place i want to change the name here the supervisor name let me change the name to abraham let me change it to abraham peter then this part that says v vp for operation i'm going to change the name here to let's say um i'm going to change it to mary nelson mary nelson okay so now i'm good let me come over here and change this the year let me come over here and change the year from 2022 to 2019 so i'm going to click it and then come over to this part and delete where yeah, it says 2022 and type 2019 so to change anything all you have to do is just to click on the thing if you are changing a text just click on it and then change the text if you are changing a background color just click on it to give you option for you to change the background color so that is it guys canva has a drag and drop feature that enables you to um, modify and create designs as though you have professional graphic design skills so now i want to change the color of this place that says certificate so i'm going to click on it and then this part that says test color i'm going to click on it and then pick any color of my choice now if you come if you scroll down this this page you're going to see different color there's black there's white there's gray there's pink there's red there's blue there's um yellow there's green so just try different colors to see what color you're okay with so i'm going to try different color i'm going to try different color so i think i'm going to go with the blue color now i'm going to come over to this place again i'm going to click on it and then change the yellow um color to blue change the yellow color here i'm going to change it to blue okay so i think uh, i don't like the look of that so i'm just going to do ctrl z ctrl z is going to undo what you've done so i'm going to do ctrl z so now i can decide to change this color of this certificate to another color if i don't if i'm not okay with the blue color to do that i'll click on the certificate and then come over to this place that says test color and then pick any other color if you don't um like the colors here or you want to use a different color all you need to do is to come over to this place this part that says add a new color click on it and then you add the color code here and then you'll be able to use the exact color you want to use another way to get a particular kind of color is for you to use this um, um pick a color icon this this um, icon that looks like a pencil click on it and then click on any um color on the design if you click on this color now it's going to pick that particular color and then to change your certificate to that color if you click on this part if you click if you pick the um, pencil the the pencil icon this icon that looks like a pencil if you click on here it's going to click it's going to change the design to yellow if you click on here it's going to change it. so that is it guys so now i'm just going to change this color now to i think i'm going to change it to this color perfect then i'm going to change this one to let's say black okay so instead of yellow let me use another color let me change the yellow color to orange or okay so let me change it to this color they come over here change the yellow color to this color that looks like red and then change the color the yellow color here to change the yellow color to this color again and then change this last yellow color 
to this color this yellow color just click on it and then change the color okay so i can click on this black and change the black to this color that's red okay i can even change the certificates to that same color or leave the certificate um okay so i think i am okay with this color so i'm just gonna leave it like this so that is it guys now once you're okay with your design the next thing you need to do is to come over to this place and change the title or the name of your design so guys canva has um flexible features to modify any design all you have to do is just to click anything on the design if you're clicking the text click the text make sure you always check this white tab for the features that are available that will enable you to modify the design if you click on the background make sure you check this tab this is just what you need to do and then you'll be able to change and modify the design now let me change the title of um this file let me just say for good and then once you're done with your design the next thing you need to do is to download your design if you come over to this place the right hand side at the top of the right hand side you see where it's where download is written this part so to download your design what you need to do is to click on this place and then you'll be asked to pick a file type now you can pick a pdf file type a png a jpeg an mp4 whatever file type you you want to choose to do that just come over to this place click on it and then you'll be given several options so here we have png we have jpg we have pdf standard we have pdf print we have svg the svg is not free then we have the mp4 video format then we have gif so now i'm going to click on the suggested one which is the pdf print now once you've picked a file type the next thing you need to do is to come over to this place and click on download it will download your design automatically now our design is downloading our design is downloading we just downloaded the design so now i'm just going to open the design for you to see um our certificate that we created on canva so guys this was the certificate we created on canva